And a very good evening to everybody. How are you this evening? It's Wednesday. It's 7.30 p.m. And it can only mean one thing. You're tuned in to the Suarez live stream. Thank you so much for joining us. We're incredibly flattered that you've made it here this evening. Well done, you. But right now, we're going to roll some VT and we'll see you back here in 30 seconds. Okay, brilliant. Welcome back, everybody. I hope you're doing really good. Have you had a good week? We've had an exceptional week, although it's been a very, very busy one. And we've had lots of hot weather here, so it's a hot and sticky one as well. Least said about that, the better. Right, um, we've, we're have we going to do some painting this evening, aren't we? We're going to do some shout-outs, run and tell your friends. It's all going on here. And don't worry, let's address the elephant in the room. There is some football going on, isn't there, tonight? Of course there is. I'm not sure where. I think I know who's playing, but hey, don't worry. We've got plenty of time before you need to tune into that. So make sure, whoever you're with and whatever you're doing, that this is your first destination because actually this is the important one. So let's do a system check and then we'll do some shout outs. So we know we've got Corner Cam working, which is brilliant. Happy days. Well, let's go to PTZ. I'll get down on my hands and knees. What up? And guess what? Woo hee! Overhead is working. Fabulous. And my favourite and yours is chest cam. Shooting. In fact, there is everybody out in Instagram world. So we'll give everyone a shout out and a wave. There we go. Instagram. That's what everyone on Instagram can see. Hello, everybody. Mr. MJM. Ah, oh, hello. 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 Great to see you here, my friend. Uh, Zane's joined us. Uh, Rose Gartato. Anki Bop. Pascal. Stone Arbor. Oh, this is fantastic. Yes, marvellous. Right. Let's have a wander around here. Now, Nancy, uh, she's liking the sheer mug. Can I tell you about that? I'm going to show everybody. So there we go. While we're on corner cam. Look, look, our favourite friend. He's here. Should we ask him? Should we ask him? Just look, we've got a Shia LaBeouf mug. Isn't that incredible? With his famous meme on it and the logo these are actually available we've got them you can buy them shameless plug coming up age is going to show you on the screen they're incredible and in fact today we've just uploaded some left and right handed ones isn't that amazing he's going to just show you on the screen and these are available incredible look at that we finally got them we finally got them I'm... pc will be blank for a second and then i'm going to show you guys on instagram what on earth i'm talking about <clears throat> So just for the benefit of you guys on Instagram, look, we've actually do it. It's a very fake. We, we play that all the time on here, don't we? The uh, the Shia LaBeouf meme. So we've actually made some mugs and they're available. You can follow the link in the bio. Ah, oh, marvellous. Look, and we've got left and right handed ones. Amazing. Join in the fun. Now, guys, the reason we got a left handed mug is because, well, I'm left handed and I always find it really, really frustrating that I buy a mug and it's for just right-handed only. So I said to Ed, please, can we put left and right-handed mugs on the merch store? Because then at least I can buy one and it's left-handed for me. Okay, there we go. So what you've got, you've got Shear on one side and you've got our Suarez paint splash on the other so you can show off to the world where who you're supporting, but also get to enjoy the Just Do It meme. Marvellous, fantastic. Brilliant. So now we've gone through that, let's give a few shout outs. Who have we got over on YouTube? I'll assume the position and let's see where we're at, shall we? All right. Uh, we've got that Suarez fella there. Uh, Funny Fox is here. Good evening. And Zane Taylor is here. Good evening to you too. Nancy Stone has joined us and uh, Denise Weeks and Ian Holmes. Great to see you here. Mark has also joined us. Otherworldly Paintings, Jay Bouvet. Bonjour. And the Rita is also here as well. Yes, and Ian supporting the uh, left-handed merch. Marvellous. Now, um, we may have some extra viewers this evening. I'm not sure if our friends from Yorkshire are here, but we had some visitors uh, arrive. Um, oh, was it Monday, buddy, or Tuesday? It might have been yesterday, mightn't it? 
all the days just flow into one they really do yes it could have been could have been monday uh no it was definitely yesterday uh so if uh, if they're watching hello good evening to you and thank you you're on holiday down here and they popped in and saw us in the gallery fantastic right let me take you through a few logistics here everybody instagram let's move you around so you can see what's going on and let's walk and talk so here's what i can tell you we are going to be painting on this giant canvas tonight we're not going to mess about because within about 60 seconds the first lot of paint is going on it's 270 centimeters by 150 so it's going to have a finished size of 250 by 130 got that you won't have to remember i'm not taking notes don't worry <laughs> but this is going to be a pretty big size painting okay and i'll tell you what we're going to do because we've got a wonderful selection of beautiful rich colors to go on here this evening and we're going to create it in waves this is all about nice waves of color cascading right across the canvas from one corner to the other it's going to look unbelievable but of course when i start and start painting you're going to think to yourself what on earth are you doing so stick around because we're going to get through this and we're going to create something utterly marvelous vicky gilchrist hey vicky hello you are here fantastic thank you for watching we've given you a shout out brilliant great great to see you here um oh jay bouvet name is jackie i will remember that jackie thank you very much right so uh nancy just to address nancy stone's point about that you could see it on instagram but not on youtube there is a delay in processing on youtube uh so don't don't panic if it's a sort of a minute or so behind where you would think it would normally be uh once we press the go button uh it does tend to process through all the internet before you can actually see it so hopefully you're reading us on both channels five by five everything should be good that's the reason why Oh, Celia Hoffman has also joined us. Thank you, Celia. Uh, brilliant. Fantastic. And Kirsty Bow. Great. Right. Fantastic. And now I'm going to show you what's in my hands. Oh, Beth uh, has joined us. Kavish. Uh, it's, oh, I can't even pronounce that. Novo Vum. There's also, I'm terrible with names. Anyway, if you just joined us on Instagram, thank you very much. Right. What can I tell you? Look, look, look. I'm not doing my Freddie Mercury impression and I'm not trying to swim down the rapids. No, this is my tool of choice this evening. I haven't used this for a while. Thought I'd mix things up a little bit. So here we are. We're going in with the woolen mop head and we're going to be working from one corner to the other in giant swoops and waves. Oh, it's a cascade of colourful joy this evening. Can't wait. So that's what we're going to use. If I should get uh, a little bit soiled with my uh, with my mop then uh which it will do because it'll go brown very quickly then you might see me interchange to some different ones but i got plenty of replacement heads and i think we're all ready to go oh and sandy mcgill says hello henry the artist has also joined in thank you so much for being here and uh i think we've got kirsty arthur did i say hello to kirsty kirsty bow yes hello right okay so the gloves are going on we're doing good you're all working really well uh right so let's get some gloves on now instagram i don't know if i can get you actually up on the table i'm going to keep you deliberately low 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 this evening because i want you to get right in on the action here so i'll tell you what we're going to do we're going to move you guys around here just so you can see the mixing station and then just before i put the paint on we're going to whiz you around a little bit okay so like i did say i'll actually just say to you guys on youtube i um i might be having a little bit of an issue with my mask this evening so if all of a sudden it starts beeping at me and I have a sudden loss of uh, air, this is a problem with the battery pack. So if I have to resort to the other mask, I, I apologise in advance. Um, the battery is charged. I don't know why it's having a bit of a, a hissy fit. But we'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. Yeah, yeah probably does need a software update. Right. Okay, if we can go on to chest cam for a second, buddy. Okay. Shading. Right, chest cam, let's look at the vast array of beautiful colours going on. we got Piaggio Green. Um, that's supposed to be Piaggio Verde, but it isn't. It's a very unusual watery blue, so we're going to use that. Actually, should we just open that? Because I'm not sure it is. Oh, yeah, no, it is. It's fantastic. It's definitely not Verde. Right, so we're going to go with these watery greens, which have got some aqua hints in them. We're going to kickstart off with this really nice kind of deep burgundy in the corner. Happy days. We've got blue metallic. No, I definitely don't want that one. Oh, I might do actually, yes. It's got a kind of watery blue in it. And then we're going to go into with the rich purple and uh, we're going to go in with the pink. We've got silver to go on. We've got brand new gold to go on. And of course, we've got a dollar for Suarez blue. We're going to pop in there. And 
<laughs> and a little drop of white and a little drop of black. So if you're ready to go, oh, I could play the drums. Maybe not. Don't give up your day job. Right. Here we go. <laughs> right. We're going to go in. So th this is all about getting the volume of paint on to begin with. So that's what I'm going to do. All right. So we're not. We're just going for it. You know. There's. There's no airs or graces. So hopefully. Um, Hopefully, if you've seen this before, you know what's coming next. So, here we go. Here we go. Are we ready? Should we just do it, buddy? Should we do it? Just do it. Do it! Just do it! Yesterday, you said tomorrow. So just do it! Make your dreams come true! Nothing is impossible! No! What are you waiting for? Do it! Just do it! Yes, you can! Do it! <laughs> Perfect! Right, so we are definitely, definitely doing it. We go, we co we're getting on here now with the uh, with the paint tonight. We're getting loads on. I hope, um, now I need to probably switch you guys around so you can see this. Sorry, Instagram. Uh, right, you just caught the tail end of the paint. That's more like it. Let's get let's get you onto the canvas so you can see what's happening. Happy days. So we've gone for the uh, the burgundy, which is kind of an odd odd kind of color. I can't really. It's almost got a chocolatey overtone to it. But we're going straight in with the purple next to it. Happy days. Right, so in the opposite corner. Oh, let's see if I can get the lid off. Lids are particularly angry these days. I can't seem to get the lids off. We're going to go with this blue metallic in the corner. Which is delicious. I love it. I love it. It's great. Right, and we're going to go with this watery blue. But I'm going to do it slightly next to it here. Though. So there's our watery kind of blue. Which is very nice. Happy days. I feel I might actually drop a little bit of French blue in there. Are we? You would like the French blue, sir? Actually, that's yellow, so <laughs> why have I picked up the yellow? That would be quite embarrassing, wouldn't it? I'll just put on some yellow. Oh, no, it's green. Uh, right. Let's get the lid off the blue. and get a little hint of French blue in there. I don't want too much. Just a little soup song. There we go. And the next one we're going to go for is... What have we got for a Johnny? Some Suarez Blue! Yay! Woo -hoo -hoo. <laughs> right, the Suarez Blue. My favourite colour. Well, apart from orange and all the rest of the other colours that I love. Right, we're going to get that over there. Now we're going to get him with the Aquas. Ooh, yeah. Nice. So, let's see what we've got here. We might have to give this a little bit of a tease, just to get it out of the tin. Right, let's get that out. And remember, if you've got any questions here, please do ask away, and we'll do our best to answer them for you. Kali Karashoka made it to the stream. Whoops, all round. All right, well done you. Top of the class. Yeah. <laughs> wow look i'm making a big drizzle all over it i love it mm, this is fun this is like cake decorating on a big scale right that's that tin done well it didn't take long to empty a tin does it right let's get some more of that green on is that these aquas are lush so let's get some more on beautiful look at that nice so we're going to get that some of that down there and some of that down there. They're quite similar, aren't they? But not the same, obviously. Nice. In fact, we'll just let that... There we go. Don't want to waste any. Nice. Very nice, that. Happy days. Right. What are we getting on next? Done my French blue. So, yes. Piaggio. That's what we want. And then we're going to get the pinks out. Ooh, nice. Big splodges of that bad boy going on. Happy days. Love it, love it, love it. Right, let's get the pink. I told you it was going to just get on. You know, we weren't going to mess about tonight. Absolutely not. Right, let's get this pink on. Now, I'm tempted to do another pink as well, but I'm not quite sure at the moment. So we're going to get plenty of that on because I've got to get the tons in. I've got to get a lot in. I've got to get paint on the canvas. I can't do this without getting paint on. So next one I'm going to do is the silver. And then we are going for some lilac. Mmm, can I get a yes for some lilac? Yay! Yes! Right, going in with the silver now. 
Nice. I want to get that on. We're going to get the gold on as well. Now, with this particular technique, I need to get most of the paint on. Apart from the few bits at the end, I need to just get it on. It's got to be on fairly early doors. So I'm going from warm to, to kind of cool. So I'm going from uh, tropical oceans to, to kind of, you know, I don't know, Arctic tundras on every stage in between. Uh, right, so I just spied my lilac. So let me get my lilac out. And then I want to put the metallic purple in as well. And then we're going to, you watch what happens. This is going to go crazy. Absolutely crazy. Is that the lilac I want? No, it isn't. Where's my lilac that I want? Oh, I'll have a drop of that pink. That pink's going to look nice. Mmm, oh yes. Yes, please. Help me some of that. We'll have a little drop there. A little drop there. Now, I need to get my, my darker tones on the outside. So, I'm just going to quickly go for the black. And then we're going to get the ourselves organized as to what we're going to do with it all right so i'm going to bring some black down here just along this edge that should be kind of nice <laughs> liking that right must change gloves oh it's all gone through onto my hands <laughs> so nancy asking about uh uh having a shoe deal have i have i got anywhere near getting a shoe deal no no at the moment we haven't i mean uh we haven't had a conversation with uh with anybody yet um but uh yeah so, i mean at some point it would be uh pretty incredible wouldn't it to uh to go down to your local well whatever it is you know, shoe retailer and find a limited edition of suarez in there i'm sure one day we'll uh we'll figure it out nancy but yeah thanks for the uh thanks for the heads up in the meantime Hello, Nelson. Great to see you. You're in Brazil. Ah, hola. Uh, oh, have I frozen in time? I've frozen in time. <laughs> I'm back. Hurrah. Uh, so, uh, funny fox. Colourful today. Yes, we did. We are, I mean, yes, we are. We are going colours today. Uh, right, okay, so let's review where we're at. The one thing I want to do before we get moving is just try and look at this uh, up here. So what we're going to do... Uh, oh, Kana, Kanabiso B1 has joined us. Violent World. Hello, we were having a chat, weren't we, earlier on uh, this week. Great to see you. Uh, Shit Kumar, Virtuosity, Violent World. Great to see you all here. Right, let's move you around a little bit, Instagram, so you can see what's happening. So this is what we've done so far. We've got... We've got plain paint on canvas, but we haven't done anything with it yet. So let me take you through the next stages. All right. And the only thing I might do is just get a drop more purple in here, uh, maybe into this kind of corner. OK, because I need a bridge uh, between the uh, the pink and the aqua. And I think that's going to do quite nicely. So let me just pick one more purple out. And I think I'm going to go for that one, actually. That's quite a nice one. And then I might pop the metallic in if we've got opportunity. So um, I've just given it a spray just with standard thinners. Um, and this just helps stop the drying of it. Uh, I don't want it to dry out too quickly. There we go. There's some purple in there. Beautiful. That's nice. OK, superb. So. I'm just going to think about this top corner because I just need to do something there. So I'm going to feature the blue and then I'm going to pop in some of this metallic. I think there's probably now about 12 colours on this. <laughs> Amazing, isn't it? When you see artwork and you think, oh, that looks really nice. And then you start, you know, particularly with abstracts, you start thinking about the colours that are involved and uh, you can get quite a lot, actually. Yeah, I think there's 13, 80, just sort of trying to count them up. I think there is probably about 13 or 14 in here so far. Okay, so... I just want to put some of the metallic purple in. Now, we used this last week on a, on a big lilac-y uh, exploration of uh, fabulousness, and it did look amazing. I was really super happy with it. So we're going to feature some of this around in the corner here. That's nice. I'm digging that. Right, I think we're about ready. Should we have a, should we have a play? See what we can do. Right, let me grab my tool. Who are missus? And uh, I'm going to spray the end of my mop. With some thinners because i don't want to be sucking valuable paint up and what will happen is is when the paint hits this it'll dissolve just a little bit but it'll mean that it spreads around the canvas a little bit easier 
Okay, so uh, I think we'll go. We'll go this side. Yeah. Right. So let's start over here. So we're going to start to move, and we're hopefully going to be bringing out some kind of horizontal shapes here. Well, that's the plan anyway. Let's let's see how we get on. All right. The mop is is an incredible tool. You can use it in all kinds of different ways, especially with things like on the sides, and you can scoop into waves. And you'll start to see this as I move around the canvas, hopefully. Fingers crossed, he said. And more so when I do start to actually move paint around. So now this is when we're going to start and maneuver it. Okay, let's see, let's see how we get on. Here we go. We're going to start moving paint over the top of paint. And this is where we start to see all the blends and the layers start to take shape. It's a quite a tricky one. I'm tempted to go around the other side, but I want to move it in a particular way. So here we are. We're going to start. This is it now. This is what we're going to start now with our waves and our cascades moving from one color to the other. Let's see how we get on. So I'm really trying to work the pressures uh, out now. Pressures, not pressures. <laughs> I need to make sure I'm, I'm applying a fairly consistent pressure all around and I'm going to start making waves and shapes look we're already starting to see some shapes starting to move nice okay now I'm going to leave the white just for a second because I want to start filter the white through there I've got another little scene through here which is fine be very careful now on how I, and when I bring the aquas in so there's all kinds of micro decisions needing to be made and I've got to try and decide that before I change heads not my own physical head of course so let's see so we're in a fairly crucial part at the moment let's bring some of some of the magenta in let's bring some of the white there we go look there we go that's better like that let's just get all that on let's see where we go if i'm quiet it's because i'm concentrating <laughs> okay that's fine so far let's move that in waves and then i'm probably going to come back around the other side very shortly see where we're at uh, this is good so now i'm just tilting uh the angle of the head a little bit so um ad i know zoomed on the mop and i'm moving fairly quickly sorry about that mate because you're, you're having to refocus and like ah he's moved again damn damn it yeah <laughs> right so okay we are let's just get it moved now and then we might be going back over the top with some some colors then just start and introduce some some different movements with the uh, with the accent colors over the top. OK, it's fine, but this is good. Let's just get the paint moving. That's what we want to do. Now I'm fine with the with the colors now and the way they're mixing with this current head. Do you want me to pull the plug? Buddy? No, still having problems with one of the cameras, guys. Sorry about that. It just keeps dropping out and being a, being a nightmare. Right. Okay. So we're into the blacks now down here, moving it, uh, moving it around. Right. Robert Mungins joined us. Hello, Robert. Thank you for joining us. A little bit late. You're forgiven. So a question from Funny Fox. Uh, are we planning to do any? Uh, videos or teaching for our younger viewers. I um, haven't actually thought about it. Uh, there are a couple of tutorials already online uh, on the channel. And uh, so, yeah, you can go back and look at those where we're just using some acrylics and some very, very simple techniques. Hopefully that might be uh, some kind of inspiration um, for him to do it. And the acrylics are easy to work with. Don't need a mask, any of that kind of thing. Um, so hopefully you can find some kind of inspiration in there and uh, Hopefully that will give you uh, give him some uh, some uh, idea about how to move forward. Uh, but yeah, nice idea, and uh, do let us know if his teacher likes it. If you manage to get that far, right? Great, fantastic. So we've got some our initial part of the canvas covered, which is great. Now what I want to do is introduce some of our accent colours. Now that I'm reasonably happy that we've got things kind of moving, I'm now going to consider about uh, how we move some of this paint around into some other areas to create the effects that we want. Now, I'm going to have a... Um, just need to just check a couple of areas to make sure I'm not missing anything. 
Right, okay, let's give that a drop of thinners. I'm probably going to change my head. <laughs> it's not what you think. It's not what it sounds like. Right, we're going to give that a little spray. We, what we want to do, why are we spraying it, Ed? Well, we want to bring out some of the metallics here and there. But more than that, I just need to keep the paint liquid. So I'm just uh, the thinners will just help keep it moving around for the duration of the uh, of the evening. So that's fine. So now I'm, I'm tempted. Now I want to bring a little bit more warmth maybe through the centre. So what I might do now is just grab a little drop of red and a little drop of cream. And I'm going to start and move some of that around. So let's see how we get on with that, shall we? Um, right. Oh, that's beautiful. That's like treacle. Yeah. Okay. I think we'll give ourselves... Let's think. We'll give ourselves a little dollop of that there. That's good. I like that. We're going to move that around. And i um, going to get my red. Let's give the red a shake. I'm tempted to put a bit of rocket red into it, actually. wonder if I should put some rocket red in. What do you think? If you were here last week, guys, you would have seen me using a horrifically expensive paint. But I'm kind of in that mood now. I think I might, you know, I think it might look quite nice. So I'm just going to get a drop of red on. Hopefully, Instagram, you can see that. Ooh, it's a beautiful red, is that? Mm -mm -mm. Nice. And you can see on chest, that's a really deep, rich red. Now, of course, what we've got at the moment, if we have a little look, there's plenty of warmth and lots of things going on here. It's all cold and uninviting over here. So let's see what happens now when we kind of jazz this up a little bit. So that's good so far. Happy with that. Now then, let me also think, what do I need to do over in this corner to make it a little bit more inviting? So I'm going to resort back to my little drop of burgundy and we're going to get some of that feathered into the edge. Uh, Robert says wading pool. Very nice, Robert. Yeah, I like that. I like that a lot. Now, we've also got, uh, we've got this nice metallic over in this corner, which is fine. And I think what I want to do is introduce a little bit of white. Actually, it's crazy. I'm going to just grab this can here and I'm going to dip my spoon in. And we are going to get ourselves a little drizzle through the middle. And we're going to see what happens next. OK, right. Let's get ourselves a little drizzle through the center. Now, a lot of this is probably going to dissolve away. We don't we don't worry about that, but I don't want to touch this yet. Um, with the mop. The other thing I'm want, going to want to get probably is another little feature of black because I need to darken some of these edges up. They're only little sort of soup songs. I don't need an awful lot, but I will probably need to put some in. Okay, superb. In fact, no, I'm going to put it in now. I'm going to put it in now. So Nancy says, how, how close is the gallery for to a church? Maybe the gremlins like to watch Ed too. Oh, I see, see the reference you made there, Nancy. Very good. Um, I don't know, actually. Uh, it's, it's a very old mill building that we occupy here, so I'm sure there's probably one or two ghosts hanging around. <laughs> well, then they probably, probably don't hang around too much with the smell of the fumes from the paint. Uh, right, OK. Um, so what are we doing? We're using the back side now. We're using the back because there's still some life uh, in the mop, which is great. So we're just going to feature some of this black. We're going to move it around a little bit. Okay, that's fine. And then we're going to do the same here. We're just going to bring this little warmth into the corner because the blue's lovely. It's nice, but uh, can't have it just on its own. Right, okay, so little drop of red going in there in a few days. Now, Ian, have you been eating a thesaurus again? Because I'm not sure I can even pronounce the title you're suggesting. <laughs> Phasing, fading spectrum, that is, that is that what that means? A diapason wane. Well, goodness me, I tell you what. That's, uh, that's quite the title. If I can spell it, it's a contender. Right, okay, so what are we doing? The cream is really thick, so we're just going to move right, these rounded globs just to try and lighten the centre up a little bit. And then we're just pulling in small little areas of additional colour as we're moving them up around. I don't mind, oh yeah, that's nice. I don't mind having, you know, a little bit of paint from elsewhere sat on the mop. No, that doesn't really matter. You know, we can help introduce a few little soups onto colour into other places. You know, probably is going to look quite nice. There we go. Look, as I'm just gently teasing some of these other tones out into the painting. And still quite adamant that I want to keep this flow, this kind of left to right thing going on. So again, I'm going to work back in waves. 
Okay, so that's fine. I think the gold definitely needs some work. We need to do something definitely with the gold here. But that's fine. That's what we're here for. Okay, so certain parts of this really, really starting to come out now. So this is great. Uh, actually, let's bring this down here and see what happens. Let's, let's soften down this, this burgundy edge a little bit because it is quite dominant, isn't it? Um, let's see if we can bring a few little pieces of that over here. Right, okay. Who's up for a drop of gold then? Who's up for a drop of gold? Let's pop some gold in. Oh, yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Right. Are we ready? Are we ready? Let's do this. Let's get the gold in. And I'm thinking right across the middle. And let's go. Three, two, one. Oh, yes. Smashing. I'm tempted to do that with white as well. Just to see what will happen. Just to see what will happen now. Definitely, while well, AD zooms in on that, we're definitely going to have to change heads out. So let me just sort that out. It won't be a second. I hope you're seeing that on Instagram okay. Right, that's one head down. Where's my other one? Right, let's get that one screwed on. So that's a different one now, which is great. Instagram, let's move you guys around here so you can actually see what's going on. Uh, Monica, Sean Louise, uh, Brian McCrusty, Ramoon, Tenorart. Great to see everybody here. And um, yes, going well. We are doing good. I like that. I like it a lot. Hmm. So tempting now to know what to which way to go. Because we're definitely getting definitely getting something going on here. I think I'm gonna leave. I like that. I think we'll leave it. I'm tempted to do that again, actually, everybody. Should we should we do that again? I think I think we should. Right, let's get some more of that on. I like that. That's they, these are our waves. This is our shoreline, isn't do it? it? Do it. There's the new one. And let's get one here. Oh. Yes, nice. Now, a lot of that's going to disappear, but that's okay. We're going in a completely different, well, not a completely different, a different direction to what I thought, which is great. Ah, I need to change my clubs again. Whoa. Right, let's get the gloves on. Right, Ian, let me give away my tip. Think of a word that you want as a base to title around, stick it into the online thesaurus and investigate options. Ah, right, that's a good tip, Ian. Thank you very much for that. Right, superb. Okay, well, AD's having a good zoom on that. We're just going to let that gold kind of separate for a moment. Uh, hopefully that's looking pretty good. At Dot Art Studios and Elam Sajapur has also joined us. Thank you for being here, everybody. Super job. Well, those aquas are really starting to develop in the center now. Loving that. What I might just do for a moment is just switch my toolage for a second. And I might now just maneuver some of this gold around i want to see what happens uh if i get if i get in here well, am i going to mess this up or uh, oh oh that's nice yeah okay okay yeah let's uh let's, let's see what happens there then okay now we're uh, we've gone from cells to actually moving the paint that's nice okay well, i'm digging that Let's have a little go with that. Should we have a go with this one over here and see if we can move some of the gold around? Oh, yeah, that's that is interesting because there is quite a volume of paint on here. So, I mean, if we can pull some somewhere else, I think uh, that could be really interesting. Yeah, that's that's nice. OK, happy days, everyone. Yeah, OK. Wow. Oh, yeah, look at that. I'll, I'll get out of your way in a minute so you can have a look. <laughs> yes, it's all very well, Ed, but we can't see what you're doing. Well, we are manoeuvring some gold around. Oh, yeah, now we've got waves crashing at the shores. This is good. I'm liking this. I'm getting super excited now. Yeah. Oh, yes. Look at that. Here we go. Yeah, that gold's really popping now. Let's see if we can move it down here. Oh, look when it hits the blue. Oh. It's just epic. Nice. Uh, Aidy's going to try and zoom in now from the overhead and try and give you a better uh, look at what's going on. Remember, if you're looking on Instagram, you can also see us simultaneously on YouTube. 
And if you follow the link in my bio, it's the very top button. And you can join us on YouTube for the four camera high definition experience. The audio might feel slightly better as well. Because on Instagram, historically, it does compress the audio down somewhat. So uh, please do join us over there if you can. It would be great to see you. Right, okay, so how are we doing there, buddy? Um, when I get up, I'll show you on chess cam exactly what we're doing here, but we're creating some beautiful... Oh, yes. Oh, yes, there we are. There we are. That's, that's what we were after. Right, let's show you on chess cam now. Oh, I hope you can start to see some of these textures and high and low points coming in. I'd imagine that's quite bright on camera, but we're starting now to pull in all this gold. This gold is really starting to bring this alive now as I... As I come around, so we're going to work this bottom half now where the cells are. And we're going to maneuver and split the white up a little bit. This is great. It's all moving in waves. It's looking beautiful. Look at that gold. Oh, look at that. Sensational. Oh, I do love some gold. Right, okay. Let's. Um, we're going to start move maneuver this. Here we go. This is this is what we came here for. Oh, let's move that out into the centre of the painting. Beautiful. Oh, nice. Nice, nice, nice. I'll buy that for a dollar. Okay, so we're just doing some careful little flicks now. It's a lovely technique. It exposes some of the paint underneath. Of course, as we build up in layers, we have this ability now to, to call on some of the things that we did earlier. And a gentle hand and a little bit of forethought. And you can be absolutely blown away by what happens. There we go. This is nice. And the gold is just creating some stunning shapes and textures here. I wish you could all be here to see it. Right. Let's, um, let's just, there's just a couple of bits of high gold. I want to, high gold. Uh, I just want to manoeuvre, so just give me a second guys, we'll come and have a look at your comments, hopefully you're enjoying this. The gold is really, really, really making such a difference now. Um, right, just got this bottom bit, just want to quickly look at that. Oh yeah, look, because we're bringing in some of, the, some of the burgundies now, which is amazing. There we go. Oh yes. So what I might do is just bring in a little bit of burgundy from the outside and just uh, feature it. Oh, this is sensational. Whoa, Ed, where did this come from all of a sudden? <laughs> there we go. Right, let's just bring that. There we go. I just want to quickly just feature maybe just little tiny droplets. There we go, look, of, of some of these colours that maybe not be featuring elsewhere. So I'm going to just pick them up and I'm going to put them on. I'm going to lay them down. Nice. Oh, we got ourselves an absolute perler appearing here. Appearing here. <laughs> Give yourself a second, Ed. Okay. Uh, Denise Weeks uh, says, beautiful. Kirsty Bow says, love it. Thank you. Wayne Tully. Hello, Wayne. You're liking it as well. Uh, Carl Miles, you're late. But get to the back of the class. Only joking. Thanks for joining us. Now uh, the Rita likes it. Uh, that's great. Thank you so much, guys. That's real. Well, everyone really enjoying it. Um, right. So here we got 32 of you online now. I'm only 15 thumbs up. If you haven't already, guys, please do give us a thumbs up. It really helps the channel. It pushes the algorithm to uh, to know that you're enjoying this and that people should be taking notice. So remember, do give us a thumbs up. If you're on a mobile dev device, just scroll down and just under where you're viewing your video and you'll just see a thumbs up icon just hit that for us that'll be fantastic and that's great remember also if you're new here please do click the subscribe button and uh, support us that way and click on your bell icon that way you never miss a thing and let's be honest why would you want to miss this we're creating something epic you don't get that by watching the football do you of course you don't right thank you guys much appreciated okay uh let's see where we're at now the gold is developing oh yes it is instagram we need to move you guys now so you can have a better look at what's going on soul rock has joined us uh hyper tears herm man and the countryside studio brilliant to see everybody here let's bring you down the cool end now hopefully you can see some of this gold starting to uh 
to really kind of take some shape. It's stormy, it's got big surges and swells within it, and it all kind of appears down here and rushes up that way. Absolutely loving that. So there's just a couple of things uh, that I want to do with this at the moment. So I'm going to come back to my to my scraper, scraper my um, grout spreader. <laughs> Great bit of kit, that. They're literally pennies. And I want to pick up a little drop of this pink, and I just want to dash it kind of over in this blue area here. So again, I've got to be fairly careful. That's it. Just, just a little, little hint of warmth over here. I'm on a limited time time with this because you are right? Oh, camera's gone. Sorry, guys. I, I just exhaled in my ears in frustration at the camera going again. We're really sorry about that. We will try and uh, get to it. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> it is. It's frustrating. I know. Mean. So, uh, right, okay, we're going to just pull just gently across here because I want to extend the beauty of this pink looks utterly incredible. So whilst we've definitely got zones and themes going on, I think it's important just to try and feature some of this elsewhere in the painting. But I think that's that's fine. That's fine. We're looking good. We're, we're doing well. I uh, like that. That's good. So I'm going to scoop a little drop of the... a little drop of this up and just pop it down here. There we go. And I don't think we're far off, everybody. Got to be honest. I mean, this is just... We're on that epic scale now, aren't we? I promised you at the start. This is going to be pretty good. Knew what I had in my head. And here we go. It's starting to look pretty good. So there's only a couple of things now I want to turn my attention to. And that's dropping some, some white or some cream into some particular places. So uh, Ian and Kelly Karashoka having a conversation about names. Uh, Kelly saying it's like alchemy. Yes, indeed it is. And then Ian saying like chromatic alchemy. Goodness me. Tell you what. Well, now we know your secret, Ian. We're not impressed anymore. <laughs> I'm joking. They're great names, guys. Where do you get them from? Right. Okay. Let me. Uh, let... Oh, look, I'm stuck to my tooling. I'm stuck to my tool -y tools. Look at that on chest cam. I'm stuck. <laughs> you see? Yeah, right, let's get rid of that. I, 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 uh, which camera are we on, dude? I thought then I might have made a mistake. <laughs> oh, dear. Right, okay. Uh, so, yes. Yes, yes, yes. Now. Let me, oh, it's all falling around me. I've got to get some of this white on in the middle, but I've got, to, I've got to get it. Like we've done up in the top corner, there's this kind of wave and wisp running through. So all I want to do now is just kind of do that over here. And then I'm going to give it a little, little bit of a drop of thinners. But I just need a little drop of white here and there. Just, just almost little droplets. And just to see what will happen. Because... The, Inevitably, with everything, there has to be kind of a focal point. So I think I'm possibly going to leave it at that uh, in terms of the white. I don't want to mess out the sort of the corners up. But you see what's happening down here. We've almost got like this kind of like um, nebula kind of thing going on, and it looks utterly sensational. So all I really wanted to do was just drop, you know, a little, a little, some bits and pieces here and there, just in the white. And this will organically now just find its kind of own level and it'll start to split and it'll start to sell and react and all those kinds of things. So that's cool. That's cool. I'm liking that. That can stay as it is. Right. Sorry, buddy. What were you saying? Right. So let me just change my uh, thing. Um, so chromatic alchemy. So beautiful, says Henry. Thank you. Uh, I know, Ed. Where can we sign up? The Rivulet forms. In the... We want to win a visit to the gallery and painting experience. Please, all this looks amazing. Sadly, count me in on gallery visit. We need a Suarez family reunion. Uh, yes, Nebula Academy. Alchemy. Right, goodness me. Well, something interesting. And I'm going to pop this out, actually, to you guys on Instagram. Um, what do we think? Should, should we offer a bit of a... Think about maybe offering some kind of competition for... Uh, for a painting experience we could do it live on camera couldn't we across the internet what do we think 
Um, that's a really, really interesting idea. Just popped up out of the blue. Hmm. What do we think, buddy? AD, you can come and get, share your thoughts with everybody. I'm sure we could do something like that. Um, now we're very close to 25,000 subs. We are, what are we, 300 away from 25,000? I'll, I'll, uh, I'll give us a yay for yay! that. But uh, yeah, we're, we're pretty close. So yeah, we, we can certainly have a think on it. I mean, bearing in mind, uh, we have a fairly heavy schedule at the moment. But I'm sure we can sort something out. Right, so thank you for suggesting that, whoever suggested it. We'll, we'll definitely have a think about that. That could be an interesting competition giveaway, couldn't it? Um, is to come here and have a day at the gallery and then do a painting, do a live stream with us and uh, get masked up and do, do get suited and booted like we do here and uh, come and see how it all works. And uh, we'll, we'll video all that for you and uh, I think that'll be quite entertaining. So we'll definitely give that some thought. So uh, excellent. Right. OK, well, um, I've just got to pull up what Nancy said as well. Give us a year's notice so you can save for the airfare. I like it. I like it, Nancy. <laughs> There is possibly another way, and that is that if we can do some kind of a uh, Zoom call or a video call of some some sort, if, if somebody was to win in the US, and they can uh, basically guide you, say colours, say what to swoop and push and pull, um, could do it that way, something like that maybe. That is a great idea, dude. Yeah, great idea. So if you're in the UK or you can get here fairly easily, then, uh, yeah, we could do it in person. And if not, as AD says, I think that's an exceptional idea. What a great thing that would be if you could uh, if you could do that remotely. I think we're definitely going to have to look and investigate that, guys. So thank you very much for your suggestion. Right. OK, we were just having a sneaky look with Instagram then on uh, how it was looking. The one thing I'm going to do, I'm just going to pop a little drop of thinners on this bit here in the middle and the very tiniest drop of special sauce because I just want to encourage this white to do a tiny bit of selling. So literally you can just see that move in a heartbeat and that's it that's all i want on that because i want the rest of it to stay as it is wow 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 who'd have thought when we were there throwing paint around that we'd get such a beautiful thing come out at the end of it well obviously i had every faith in myself because i know what i'm doing <laughs> well i think it's fair to say this is going to form a beautiful a stunning painting when this is all dry Let's look at what we've got, guys. We've got these waves coming in. There's a cascade all the way through. I could see this as a poor portrait painting as well as one that's sitting on landscape. We will, of course, give you some proper look at this once when it's dried and stretched around the frame. Uh, we might even start the live stream looking at it in a week or two when this is all dry. But for now, what can I tell you? We've got these epic rivulets of gold which are forming in structures all throughout the painting. We've got waves of colour going from one to the other to the other. We've got features going on all over the place. We've got twists and turns and rivers and valleys. And now we've got cells and we've got nebulas and we've got dust clouds and we've got coral reefs. Oh, my word, it's all going on. Look at that sensational. So I think I am probably done with that because I don't really want to do anything else with it. That's looking pretty good. What do we think there, guys? Yeah. So I'll give you a wander around with the chess cam, okay? Who was that? Who said AD is a genius? Nancy. Of course he's a genius. Have you only just realised that? <laughs> right, let's see if we can have a look on chess cam as I go down, down, down on this sensational gold. <gasps> when the light hits it, look at this. Honestly, I don't have the words. I should have sent a poet. Look at that as we go around. Yeah, I've watched Contact with Jodie Foster. Uh, look at this, the gold's just weaving all these incredible shapes through it. Almost like mountain ranges, I guess, as we come around and we go into the burgundy where we first started. And we've got this rich, intense gold manoeuvring its way around in some incredible and spectacular shapes. Then we get this giant wave of pink moving into the tropical ocean green. Now we're just starting to see all the corals starting to pop and appear and come out of nowhere and the hydrothermal vents beautiful what are we then getting to we get into tropical seas and the coolness of the silver and all manner of beautiful tiny feathery strands coming through and finally we end up with this gorgeous rich blue that you could almost walk through it is that rich and beautiful <gasps> well what can i say everybody look at that haven't we done well between us all give yourselves a round of applause i know i will that is pretty good. 
Um, <laughs> Carl Miles says this. Yeah, and a round of applause. Um, we, uh, this is the best distraction to the football, says uh, Carl. Thank you, Carl. That's very kind of you. Uh, uh, Nancy, still like coral reflections. That's very nice, coral reflections. Uh, Ian, going to add another colour to the ongoing piece at the back. Yes, good idea, Ian. Right. I'm calling it now on the main piece for today. That is now done. Well, we have to do something at the back, don't we? Right. We need a colour on there. I think it's got to be something to do with aqua, don't you? What about Pi what about the Piaggio Verde? Let's brighten that up a little bit, shall we, guys? Let's do that. That's what I'm feeling. Right, when you're ready then, buddy, I'm going to pull you around uh, Instagram. Thank you for reminding us, Ian. That's very kind of you. If you just joined us on Instagram, we're now... I've just turned you around, and we're going to put some colour onto the one that we do every week. I say we do every week. We've been a bit lapsed recently because we've been so busy. Right, okay, so are we on chess cam, dude? Right, I'm going to put a little feather through the middle of this. If we're ready, let's have a little go and see how we get on. And here we go. Yeah, it's just snaking that through the middle. And that's perfect. That's all it needs for tonight. Nice. Actually, that's really shaping up into be something pretty damn special. I like that. Hmm, I do like that. That's really coming on. Yes, that green really pops now. What do we think? Look at that. Fantastic. Um, Decchio Art, Feather Art, Must Massage, and Charlene Airy Magazine Publisher. Also joined. Great to see you guys. I'm going to give you a, a little whistle-stop tour of this when we've um, when we finish the broadcast on YouTube, so you can have a proper look at what we've done. And Aid is zooming over on uh, Caterpillar Painting at the back, <laughs> just to give you a proper look at what's going on. Helix Caterpillar. The Helix Caterpillar. There you go. <laughs> awesome. Well, how have we enjoyed that, everybody? Have we enjoyed that? Thank you, Kirsty. One of your faves so far. Carl Miles said we nailed it. Thank you. Perfection from Nancy Stone. Uh, you're all very, very kind. Coral Reflections. My goodness me. What a great one. Well, okay. So uh, 33 viewers and 23 likes. If you did enjoy this, guys, come on. Give us a thumbs up. We hope you've enjoyed it this evening and we have created something marvellous. So hit that thumbs up button and uh, show us that you've enjoyed what you've been watching. OK, and we'll be taking notes. OK, guys, well, that's it for this evening. We're going to wrap things up now. If you're an England supporter, good luck with tonight's game. If you're not at all bothered by the football, then don't worry about it. Uh, we'll just carry on as normal. Anyway, guess what? We're back same time next week on the 14th of July on Wednesday at 7.30 and we can't wait to do that. And I've got to tell you, and I promise you this with a hand on my heart, I'm going to come a little bit closer. Wow, have we got a live stream. And I mean, this could quite possibly be the very greatest slice of genius you're ever going to see. AD has been stupidly busy creating something that is so big, so awesome, and so unique and groundbreaking, I can barely contain my excitement. And it, I've been with him while he's been doing it. So I promise you, make sure you clear your schedule. Come back next week, because you do not want to miss this. You need to see it live, because it is going to be absolutely breathtaking. I promise you. Please rush and tell your friends. I mean that in all sincerity and being genuine. You know, we don't, we're not sponsored. We don't, we don't sponsor. You're our sponsors. You are the people that support us. We can't do it without you. We really need you on this one. Promote it if you're on social media. Let everybody know. The link will be live tomorrow. We'll put it out on social. But next week is literally going to be one of the greatest visual spectacles you are ever going to see. And I'll leave it at that. Okay. So we look forward to seeing you then, don't we? same time next week <laughs> for something you're never going to forget guys thank you ever so much for watching on behalf of Adi and myself and we wish you a great rest of day and wherever you are whoever you're with and whatever you're doing please stay safe and we look forward to seeing you same time next week for doing something truly unbelievable but on behalf of us both and from Suarez HQ we are officially out of here and have a very good evening <laughs>